Hi, I'm joined here with uh, Tom and Robbie, and we're going to react to three opening sequences. So we've already got them playing on the screen. So I'll let them watch it, and then I'll ask them a few questions about what they think. Yeah, so that's the first one. So, uh, what was your overall feeling about that? Um, I was saying to Tom, it kind of very much reminded me of James Bond, except mm. yeah. a more sort of bold, abstract version. Yeah, I mean, very stylized, like had a lot of very flat colors. Mm. But yeah, no, I liked it. Has that pulled you in to like want to see the full movie? Like, uh, has that like grabs grabs your attention uh, towards the film? I mean, you obviously it, it, yeah, it was it, intriguing. Like, has it drawn you in? I'd say um, it hasn't particularly drawn me in. I wouldn't. Mm. I, I don't feel any strong feelings towards that film. Yeah. It's in like, oh, I, I need to go see that film now. But equally, I I feel like it's a good intro. Yeah. So we'll start with the next one, which is uh, Godzilla, uh, 2014, the like, latest oh. one. So as soon as that plays.
And that's the end of the second one. Um, so overall, how did you feel about that one? Um, I'd say that was more impressive than the first one. I'd say you, you definitely get a sense of the whole sort of superstition kind of Cold War era mm -hmm. yeah. like, mystery about it. I really like the use of the old footage and I, yeah, re I really like the grainy like, kind of. Yeah, and it especially, um, I thought it was really cool. Like again, like the last one it was stylized, but I really liked how, uh, you know, where like the names were blocked out or things around mm. the names yeah, were blocked yeah, out yeah. to kind of give you that feeling of like a, yeah. you know, it's a government agency trying to hide yeah. things. Um, yeah, no, I thought it was, there, I thought it was better. There was an aura of suspicion. <laughs> From the first uh, three or so minutes of this opening sequence, I, can you like, does it tell you anything about the film? Like, can you infer anything from um, these first few well, minutes? Well, I mean, it's a Godzilla film. Yes, yeah. <laughs> you can uh, see, I mean, you can see Godzilla in the water. So yeah, it's not hiding what the film's about. But in a way, that's what's fun about Godzilla because everyone knows what's coming, mm. and everyone yeah. knows what's hiding around the corner. Mm. And it's a bit like Jurassic Park, isn't it? Like, yeah, it's... you know what you're scared of, but they're still sort of hiding it from you. They're still hinting at it, and that just adds to the, the tension and also the fun. That's yeah, good. Like it builds yeah. up tension really well. Yeah, that's yeah, good. Like it builds yeah. up tension really well. Yeah, good. All right, we can uh, roll the final one now. And this is um, Fast and Furious 7. They say if you want to glimpse the future, <laughs> just look behind you. I used to think that was bollocks. And now I realise. You can't outrun the past. <laughs> when we were kids, Stop fights with the toughest bastards in the yard. I was the one with the step in and finish him. You'd steal from the corner shop, but it was me. <laughs> I braved the old man's belt. I'd hoped you'd have grown it. The plan the gangster made you harder. <laughs> Smarter, better. But deep down, I guess I always knew you'd end up like this. Despite everything I did teach you. Still, you're more flesh and blood. So you remain. I crossed the bear. Now, little brother, while I sell you one last score. Take care of my brother. Anything happens to him, come by looking for you. War for war, bodies that hit the ground. You ready for us, cause it's about to go down. Push him to the left, push him to the right. Uh, load the choppers up, hit him on sight. Uh. I ain't never ran from a gunfight. This is you and me. Mano y mano, you're damn right. Don't act like you don't know. No one I came for. Too late to turn back. This is the payback. Yeah. You take one, I take one. You can't hide, you can't run. Hold this. Don't act like you don't know. Know what I came for. Too late to turn back. You take one, I take one. You can't hide, you can't run. This is the payback. <clears throat> so, uh, what can you tell about the film from this? Um, well, 
I just like to, I, I I like the whole um, first off the whole continuous camera thing. I'm a big fan of yeah. when it uh, yeah. without breaks, you know. Yeah. But what can you tell about that film? Well, it's, I mean, it's <laughs> a very kind of it. I know it's a Fast and Furious movie, but yeah. it definitely had a very kind of generic feel to it. And I know they were trying to be like self-aware now, with like the putting yeah. sunglasses on the explosion behind. But I don't know if that would really draw me in, in the sense that... Uh, no, it wouldn't it's... draw me in. It, it does, um, I hope they're self-aware. Yeah, it almost kind of like... But it, it definitely... Away. You definitely know what you're getting. Well, as with the Godzilla, I mean, within the first sort of minute there, you've already got guns, explosions, yeah. cars. It um, kind of defines the movie, doesn't it? Yeah, it's gonna so be more it's, it's within the first few... It's not a gentle hope. For no, that. it gives you like the feel of the film. So like the Godzilla, the Godzilla film, you could really kind of tell what the themes were going to be like, like yeah. government and stuff. Like but then that. equally, then the, both of them are very big sort of blockbusters, so they're going to need to establish that straight away. So yeah. you can kind of forgive them. Yeah. yeah. I mean, what could you tell about the character? I mean, this is one of the main characters in the film. What could you tell about him from the first few minutes? Because you, you're introduced to him first, you see his face after this London yeah. skyline is kind of mysterious. What, yeah. could, what else could you tell? He's uh, definitely not shy of retiring. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Confident, isn't he? It's, uh, there's a sort of... Very kind of experienced. Yeah, there's a ruggedness, you know. Mm. There's mm. past past adventures there. Yeah. Um, yeah, like, he was just very confident in the way that... He had a very confident walk. Um, yeah, very confident face. Yeah, very confident <laughs> face. And uh, in terms of the music in the background, um, there's like a small sa a, a silent soundtrack in the back. What could you tell about that? Like, what does that make you feel? Does that put you on edge or...? Um... I... I, I suppose... Could you tell it's like, like, a, like an action film kind of thing with yeah. the sound? Like, it's not yeah. like a, a yeah. silent, like, orchestra. It's like a mm. sharp, yeah. loud yeah. Yeah, yeah, building yeah. sound. Yeah. 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 I suppose I didn't really think too deeply about it because I know it's a bit precious on my half bars coming mm. as well as expected. So. Well, uh, thank you guys. Yes, uh, thank you. Cheers. All right.